Well, Coco, it's, it's hot out here, but what was that celebration with the white towel you were doing? That was like the Spanish bull going through the, didn't you, was that not, did you not, guys not get it? <laughs> Maybe it's just me, but oh. I'm sorry, I thought you were from the USA and she was from Spain. Yeah, but I beat Spain today. I mean, come on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll take your word for it. Now, Coco, what were your thoughts? You're two from two in 2017. Serve was a pretty big factor today. Oh, Jesus. I felt like my serve was just all over the place a little bit. I thought bit. it was good. Oh, okay. I don't know. I have to look at the stats, but I mean, it was good when it counted, which is important, but uh, at the end, when I got the break, I felt a little bit more cruising in the second set, uh, able to hit my spots a little bit better, but I was a little bit on and off with it, but hopefully I can tighten it up a little bit further down in the year. We were saying in the telecast about the incredible sporting family that you come from. For the fans here, I mean, the fact your mother represented the USA at the Olympics in both swimming and volleyball, which is insane. What a thrill it must have been for you to become an Olympian like your mum last year in Rio. Yeah, um, it was really something special. It was probably the biggest dream of mine to be an Olympian. You know, hearing about it from my mom all the time about, you know, the Olympics is the creme de la creme of all athletes. And so any sport I was playing, all I wanted to be was an Olympian. And I just happened to go into tennis because of my older brother. And here I am in the Olympics. And so I asked my mom if she could come. And so it was kind of like a mother-daughter moment of two Olympians out there. And we had a really great time. And she kind of was back in the limelight a little bit, which she liked. <laughs> Very cool. Now, just finally, the mixed. You guys were having a whole lot of fun the other day, but you realize now you're getting towards the point of maybe playing for a spot in the final, depending on how Jack singles goes. Things could be a little bit more serious today. Yeah, I mean, hopefully uh, Jack does his job today in the singles. Um, I'll be out here cheering him on a little bit. Um, and then in the mix, you know, I couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't believe when the umpire did the serve and just totally took a tumble. <laughs> that was like the most ridiculous thing I've seen. I don't think he could do it twice, if, even if he tried, but uh, it was all in good humor. You know, I was out there having fun, worked on what I needed to work on on the returns, because the first day I felt my returns were a little bit shabby, but, you know, we tightened it up and ended the day 3-0. All right, stick to you guys playing the tennis, the Lions people calling the Lions, <laughs> all right? Coco, you're off to a great start again. Coco Vandewey, everyone.